You were right before. I am seeing somebody else. So Craig is gay. I don't know. You, you don't know. You just you just said that. I, he, he said that he's seeing another man. We didn't exactly discuss the specifics of how he identifies. Okay, right. Brady, he's in so much pain, but he says he loves my mom, but then he also says... Says what? He says that he's in love with this other guy. I don't know. I mean, I get this sense that maybe he's been in denial this entire time, but it just feels like it's really new to him. Yeah. But at the same time, I don't really give a damn about his pain because of what this will do to my mom. No, yeah, yeah. I, it's okay. I get it's it. Just, oh, I, d- I told him he's got to tell her the truth. She deserves to know the truth. But Brady, uh, I think it's going to be bad. I knew it. I knew it all the time. Yes, there's something else I need to tell you. No, 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 no. You just spare me the details. I don't want to find out that it just happened or that she completes your other hey, load hey, of crap. Hey. Can we keep our voices down? You mean me? You want me to keep my voice down because I'm the one being loud? Why, he just sits there like the sleazy little wimp that he is. Nancy, let's go. I'm not going anywhere with you, you, you son of a bitch. Probably poison the apple. That's what witches do. What the hell did you give me? How the hell do I get out of here? I don't know. I, I don't think that phone call proves that it wasn't Kristen in the mask. I mean, we know that she has the technology to be me, to be Nicole. She could be Joan of Arc, for all we know. I mean, certainly she could fake a phone call. She said that Gwen entered as if on cue. Like, like the whole thing was staged.